Okay, I'm going to try this again. I tried uploading a video to YouTube and it wouldn't let me. So, I'm going to approach it a little different. Alright, so I googled how many deaths there were in certain counties in North Carolina on December 8th. Actually, it showed me a chart of all of them. I just went directly to the same date, December 18th, just a random day. So there were 52 deaths in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven counties that I checked. And I could have kept going. I could have kept going, but they would have all said 52 deaths. <clears throat> they would have all said 52 deaths, because why not? Why not? On December 18th, every county in North Carolina, basically, or at least every single one, I didn't check, every single one that I checked was 52 deaths, so I just stopped at, some, at that point. And it wasn't just this date, by the way. I checked other dates. I checked yesterday's date. They were all like 80 deaths, every one of them. Every single one of them, same counties, 80 deaths on yesterday's date. How's that happen? Divine intervention to kill everybody? Or nefarious whatevers. I think we all know. So could anybody else do this and let me know what you find. Is North Carolina just lazy in their reporting and they just like whatever just make all of them the same. Who cares? Nobody checks. Or are all the states that bad and lazy and obvious? This is obvious. This is so obvious. Oh, and by the way, Alamance County is where LabCorp is headquartered, which I live in Guilford County personally, but really close to Alamance County. So I basically spend all my time as far as in town in Alamance County. That's where I work. That's where I shop. That's, you know, everything. And that's where Lab Quarters is headquarters. Lab Corps is headquarters. I can't talk this morning. So, not only are there labs there, all their whole you know billing, processing, everything's there. And my best friend works at the lab, and she's over here at my home twice a week, visiting. And we, she. This is so ridiculous. They've had two cases, two confirmed cases in the whole lab. I mean, this is a huge, huge lab. I mean, lab core. This is lab core. They're huge. Like, largest employer in Alamance County. So, yeah. Everybody should basically be dead or dying in Alamance County, if that was the case, you know, if it was a real contagion, that the lab, the county that the lab is located in would be flooded with people exposed to it, and it would be devastating, if it was real, it would, it would be, that would be real, let's be real, let's just be real about it, use common sense, common sense says, this is a lie, And the numbers are false, and there's another agenda, and they don't even hide it. But let's be positive, because at least we know it, and there is a lot we can do just by knowing, and that's sharing that peace of Christ with others, to not worry. And we can make it. But So if you nobody has any ideas like if you want to look it up or or if you have found things like this let me know I don't I'm sure I'm not the only one that could find this because I'm like you know I'm not computer savvy I'm not technologically savvy I can't even speak today so that tells you half of but anyway I know what you know you know what you know you know have a good Wednesday